Are we jumping on the viral bandwagon way too quickly? You are watching Hashtag with Saad Taslim. It seems that anytime anything happens anywhere in the world, we feel like we must comment on it. We jump online, whether it be Facebook or Twitter or whatever, and anything that's making its way around the news cycle, we feel like we have to give our opinion regarding. We have to comment. We have to say something, whether we agree or we disagree. And the sad reality is a lot of times we're not even sure where we stand on the issue, but we feel like we have to say something. A Muslim, by default, actually should refrain from speaking as much as possible. Because the more we say, and by the way, speaking online is still speaking. It's still speech that we could be held accountable for. The more we say, the more we're going to be held accountable for. And this is why the Prophet ﷺ, he said, مَنْ كَانَ يُؤْمِنُ بِاللَّهِ وَالْيَوْمِ الْآخِرِ فَلْيَقُلْ خَيْرًا أَوْ لِيَصْمُتْ That the one who believes in Allah and the final day should say that which is good or remain silent. When we do that, when we only say that which is good, we, we make sure that everything we say we're being rewarded for. And we're making sure that we don't say things that will cause us to be sinful or that we'll be held accountable for on the day of judgment. So my advice to myself and to everyone is that take your time, don't feel pressured to always comment on everything. And we should be as Muslims, humble enough to say, you know what, I don't know. You know what, as a Muslim, I think we should ask somebody who knows better. Allah says, ask the people of remembrance, ask the people of knowledge, if you don't know. So leave the issues to the people of knowledge. Wait for the facts. If you feel like you must say something, just wait. There's no rush. Until next time, inshallah ta'ala. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.